Hello, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today is going to be a video um, explaining what the Gutenberg uh, page builder editor is of WordPress and then how you can change that back to the classic editor which um, a lot of people prefer. So it's quite a few years ago now, uh, probably like 2018 or something, 2019. Um, WordPress released a new editor um, to manage pages. So this is Gutenberg. Um, to be honest, it's been around yeah for a good number of years and we just don't use it. We always use like WP Bakery or Elementor to build out the pages. Um, and we just find this really annoying, this page editor. Uh, so even when you add new blog posts, it's the same, you put in the title. Uh, and there's no, there's no like lines around the page. <laughs> I, I can't, I don't know how to describe it. But if you are familiar with WordPress, then you will be familiar with um, the standards like uh, the text area, the title field, which had very clear defined areas where you want to edit uh, the page. And actually when you click on plugins, straight away the very first plugin is classic editor so what i'm going to be showing you here is how to um, reactivate that reinstall that functionality so we want to install this plugin uh, so just install activate and then if you go to add new page you can see it's defaulted back to um, the classic page editor you probably haven't got this, this is specific to our theme. So instead of that white black canvas, that white blank canvas, yeah, um, you've got these text fields and the side panel is back again. And this goes for the same for the widgets. Uh, they updated the widgets, I'm not sure when it was, um, a little while ago too. If you prefer how it used to be, uh, you can just install a plugin for this. So add new plugin and then classic. This is one you want. See, it's got over 2 million active users, so a lot of people prefer it. And then if you go to widgets again, there you go. So it's defaulted back. To me, it's just a lot easier to navigate and see what you're doing. Um, compared to the updated versions and a lot of people must agree. Um, Otherwise, it wouldn't be so so popular. I'm not sure how much. See the classic editor that's got over 10 million active installations, which is crazy. Five star. So yeah, that's how you can. Um, that's two plugins to um, go back to the default way of editing your WordPress pages, posts, and widgets. Thanks for watching.